answer. What's the marking scheme and pattern for maths board exam? Well, class 10 maths board exam comprises of six units, namely algebra, mensuration, coordinate geometry, geometry, probability and trigonometry. Now, out of the six units, I would say algebra and mensuration are your two vital units as they comprise of more than 50% of your marks. So, out of algebra and mensuration, you can expect three to four very long answer type questions from these two units. Moving on to coordinate geometry, it's one of the easiest and the most scoring topic as it involves just three simple formulas. So once you start your revision, go for coordinate geometry to gain some really momentum. Another important unit is geometry. It involves circles and construction. In circles, you can expect a four mark question on a proof which involves congruency, especially the RHS congruency. In constructions, I would say, please practice the three specified construction in the class. Coming to probability and trigonometry. For these two units, it has been seen for the past few years that questions either directly from NCRT or based on the same lines that are given in the NCRT are asked. So I would say for these two units, solely consider on NCRT. In the end, I would just like to say that stay calm, composed and all the best guys.